Hey you everyone and welcome back to another fun episode of Skyrim. If you remember in the last episode, we went and got those two hordes of powers from Rag no Vold, I think it's me. called. And I'm also as as we went over to some Gro Gorg. Yeah, Gorge and we unlocked it there too. Also we got a note from this guy, remember. We helped him out a while back when his master was trying to get the white file. When we recovered it, it was broken. Now he's texted us, or sent us a message saying that he can, we can, My do, master, we can help. I'll him. never have Master Norellian skill with potion. Hey. Good to hear. You can be a difficult Sorry, man to find. It. Thankfully, those couriers are tenacious. Sorry. Sorry. I have some you think thoughts. you can know how to repair the file? There are three crucial elements. Some may be easier to find than others. On the top of the throat of the world is a patch okay. of unmelting snow. No heat can touch it. Then we need the tusk of a mammoth, okay. ground to a fine powder as only the giants know how. The final step is tricky. It okay. requires the briar heart from a forsworn of the reach. If you can bring me these materials, oh, I got the file that. can again be made whole. I'd better get going. Find some mammoth tusk powder. So, oh man, yeah, bring her, bring him a force horn heart. This is, I can get one of them. I have one of them. But you know what? Just because it wants me to. Mm-hmm. Yep. I got some earlier this month and it's doing wonders for me. I might buy a second one because I hurt this one. Yeah, no. Look! Oh! Yep. You're better already. Yeah, it's a little bit of a problem. <clears throat> I guess I shouldn't land right in the middle of everything, should I? Hmm. Oh well. We learn as we go. Got the wind guide. Okay, let's actually go for Mammoth Tusk. Oh man. Yeah, you don't even get to see this creepy ass fucking thing. Looks like a beetle about to eat its prey. And you guys will notice that I have not eaten a single body since we did that mission.
Okay. I know I can get snow from the top of the world. Not from throughout the world. I think that's why if I like that deer is gone. Yeah, I think that's why I waited so long. Guys, but yeah. Great, got no one in case of an hour when the first set to pop up. Great. Okay. We can get this one. We can get this one easy because it's up there by the Nox pickaxe. The best part is Parthenax, it will actually be in. Hey, buddy. He won't attack us. Hey, buddy. No. Well, we gotta go kill this asshole. Yeah, now we gotta go talk to this guy. Yeah, we're gonna go over to it. Instead of having to go over so many freaking mountains. This will help us probably. <laughs> we're we're saving here. Excuse me. I might be fast traveling. You no, fuck it. We're, we're just jumping over there. I'm not dealing with this. I want to get this done, over with, because then I want to go get this freaking uh, King Olaf's speech or thing. Get that done with, and yeah. Now I'm part of the Bard's College. I'm part of everything. Yeah. 
Yeah, there we go. He can take care of him. I take care of him. Yep. What was that? No one escapes. Yeah. Yeah, I guess I'm not gonna work to move. I guess. I want the fish yet. Oh, I'm gonna force one. Come back here for Red Eagle's Fury. If you want, you can keep going back to Red Eagle. Yeah, to Red Eagle's uh, whatever his cavern, and you can keep changing it in for a. Uh, yeah, you can keep changing it in. So now we have both Red Eagle's Fury and Red Eagle's. Uh, I think it's either Bane or Rebuff. So we have both now. Alright, this episode's going a lot faster than I thought I was going to. When I first did this, the giants were the ones that gave me the most trouble. But then again, about this time, when I did my first ever playthrough, I was still on uh, Ebony. Just straight Ebony. I'm actually wondering. Names okay, Pit Pocket saw it on. The townsfolk call me captain because I used to be a sailor. Cool. The white file. We're back. And we got everything you need, pal. The unmelting snow, everything. My master can be a bit short tempered, but I thank the gods. I have the I'll get to work on the file straight away. Cool. Yeah, I'll let you do it right here. He's going up to show his master. Yep, that's not where he's going. Master, look. It's the file. What? How? It doesn't matter. Look. It's refilling with your tonic as we right. speak. Marvelous. Oh. Nice. Oh. He is gone. But thanks to you, he died knowing his life's work was not in vain. As am I. Sorry to hear that. You acted very nobly in helping my master realize his life's work. Thank you for that. As for myself, mm -hmm. I've always been content to simply be an alchemist. I fear keeping the file would just remind okay. me of Norellian's obsession and how it consumed him. Here, keep it. You are as much a part of its legend now mm. as Corral Mill was. I hope it brings you the happiness that my master desired. Now, how would you like no me problem. to align the file's properties? I'm not as skilled as Corral Mill, so I'm afraid it will okay. only ever refill with one type of liquid. I like the power of healing. I understand. Health. Good day, friend. Keeping well? <clears throat> and preparing the file now. The white file. 
well, yep, you can see where it's repaired kind of shittily. But this file now will refill every day. It's not even ha so. Say we got hurt. Dang, dude. Not to be cold in this time of your life. I'll never have mastered I kicked the, the master. Kick the corpse out of the bed upstairs. Well, if you study long enough, you might. Alright, so that is the end of the life file. Now we have a reusable. Yeah, a reusable. Uh, soul gem, and we have a reusable. Yeah, we have a reusable everything. Yeah, let's get over here so we can help him. We need to do this. This is for the Bard's College. Getting King Olaf's, uh, yeah, King Olaf's speech or play or poem, whatever it is. Oh, many species of bear roam. Oh, crap. I've been hunting and fishing in these parts for years. Good for you. Good for you. Where do we go? No, the Mirelark skin. Or the. <laughs> Really? Every episode now. Second, third one in a row. I'm ballsy, but I'm not that ballsy yet. Dragon Rend makes everything so much easier with being able to bring them to the ground. When they're in the air like that, a being able to bombard you, I can't do much. There's a whole bit to it. Follow the ghost, pretty much, I guess. Isn't a hard mission. ones that take time.
goes, buddy. Now I kill him. This is the right way, but I'm following up. Magically sealed, great. Cool. 
fuck's he doing? Oh, nice for four. Danny, what's he with this one? This is a master. So let's see if where the last one was. Nope. On the other side. Nope. Ah, right now is where I wish I could go back to the Shadow Sepulchre and get that unbreaking one. Yeah, the unbreaking one. I don't even know. God damn it. Got it. Supposed to do. Oh. Uh. But I want to get through that magically sealed door. Back through a magically sealed door if I can. Apparently someone killed this one. Thank you. Perfect. 
get the turret. I'm not in sufficient charge. Shit. I don't think I can do that. Oh, I Someone has been putting in the mods already in this game. Because I've played this game before. I've played going through like this. I've never seen a barrel of stone. Let's see what this damn thing is. Because I've never heard of a barla stone before. I thought I picked one up. Brother, no, no, no. I'll come back for you two later. <laughs> oh, I'm good, the bear. 
I think I'm plenty far enough. I can jump over now. Mm-hmm. Maybe I should learn that one. The uh, black list. Wait. I know you. No, you don't. Don't lie to yourself. Don't lie to yourself. You know, no one knows me. Heck, I don't even know me. Not me. You know how hard it is to not know yourself? Alright, and we even got a new word, and we saw two dragons. We saw, I'm not fighting two at once. I have no win, I have no dragon rat. Lady Atia says my voice is second only to hers, but she's seven. Ah, hey. I have to admit, I didn't think it would actually be there. Now, let's take a look at this. Oh. No problem. Oh, no. This won't do at all. The copy is incomplete. It's aged to the point that parts are unreadable. And the parts that are readable... Okay. Well, bardic verse has come a long way since ancient times. It means okay. I can't read it to the court. Without the verse, I won't be able to convince Elisif of the importance of the burning of King Olaf festival. If she isn't convinced of the festival's importance, then hmm. she won't reverse her decision to stop the effigy burning. It means that the burning of King Olaf, which the Bard's College has held for time immemorial, won't be happening. Okay. Make it up? Why can't we that doesn't seem appropriate. I suppose I could copy his style based on what you brought me, but I have no idea what happened in between these verses. Okay. Oh, Olaf, our subjugator, the one-eyed betrayer, death-dealing demon and right. dragon-killing king, your legend is lies, lurid, and false. Your cunning capture of Numenex, uh -huh. a con for the ages. King Olaf was Olaf One-Eye? Right. He famously captured the dragon Numenex and took him to Dragon's Reach. What did we say really happened? Hmm. Hmm. Olaf was Numenex. Hmm. Uh, Olaf did Olaf. become king, and Numenex escaped later. Yeah. It's, it's entirely possible. And I'm sure the court will like that. I'm writing it in. Mm -hmm. Olaf grabbed power by promise Next. and threat. From fall grief to winter hold, they fell to their knees. But solitude stood strong, mm -hmm. Skyrim's truest protectors. Olaf's vengeance was instant, mm -hmm. inspired, and wicked. Strange. According to history, Solitude hmm. attacked Winterhold, but Asgir seemed to be saying Olaf reacted. Okay. What did we say happened? I order disguised troops to attack Solitude. Solitude tending. Okay. Oh, he sacked That and sounds good. Uh, I'm not <clears throat> sure the court will believe that Olaf had hmm. wizard powers, but we should see. It has mm -hmm. a few final lines, but that's all we needed to add. I need all to right. head to court immediately and present this. You should come. 
I am Dean hey. of Loot at the Bard's College, and no, I don't give a rank. Yeah, private lessons, yeah. It takes two things to be a good play skin flute. The first is patience. The second is a firm wooden stick for wrapping knuckles. This is alright. Cool. Hi, right, meet you over here. We can easily get this done. Come on, hurry up, buddy. You can do it, man. Slowly but surely, you can do it. I believe in you. Come on. You can do it, buddy. He's coming over the ridge. The light is upon his hair. Up, up. The white has formed over the face. He's coming. He's coming. He's coming. He's here. All right. Easy enough. I do hope the court likes the purse. I think we've done an excellent job of recreating it. Hmm. Really? What are you doing? I do hope the court... I think my voice ready? is ready. I hope we've done this well. Me too. Howdy, y'all. Word. I wonder what that cook's doing. Where's the queen? Where's the fucking queen? Nothing here, but everyone's looking this way. Where the fuck's the queen? She ain't in her room. Before I even think about it. Ooh, that I do want to steal. No problem, I'll get a second one too. Biormo, I assume you are here to petition for the reinstatement of the burning of King Olaf festival. I am, Jarl. Yes, we are. I wish to present King Olaf's verse from the Poetic Edda, recovered this very day from the Bard's tomb. You mentioned something that would convince us the yeah. festival should take place, but I didn't expect King Olaf's lost verse. Please proceed. Oh, Olaf, our subjugator, the one-eyed betrayer, Death-dealing demon and dragon-killing king, your legend is lies, okay. lurid, and false. Your cunning capture of Numenex, a con for the ages. No shouting match between dragon and man, no fire or fury did this battle entail. Olaf struck a deal to make himself king. Right. Numenex let go. Though none tell that tale. Olaf grabbed power by nice. promise and threat. From fall grief to winter nice. hold, so they fell to their knees. But solitude stood okay. strong, Skyrim's truest protectors. Olaf's vengeance was mm -hmm. instant, inspired, and wicked. Because solitude would not right. soon bend knee, Olaf would hurt them while his status accrued. He sacked Winterhold, his only okay. true ally, and used magic bold to blame solitude. 
So ends nice. the story of Olaf the liar, a thief and a scoundrel. We of solitude commit to the fire. In solitude, bards nice. train for their service. They also gather each year and burn a king who deserves it. You have proven your point, Viarmo. The festival is truly a celebration of nice. solitude and a condemnation of false kings. I thank you, and the college thanks you, Jarl. Furthermore, I believe that such nice. a fine poem deserves some payment of patronage. The college will be moderately rewarded. Oh, thank you yet again. I will make thank sure you. our applicant, who was instrumental in recovering the poem, will be well rewarded. Unbelievable! Thank you. You have done us a great service here. I can't begin to thank you enough. No problem. Soon. Soon. Does mean I'm bored now? These things must be done properly. You will be inducted as part of the festival itself. I need you to go speak nice. to Jorn. He was preparing the effigy of King Olaf. Tell him to finish the preparations. The festival is back on! Yay! The Imperial... Okay, I'm gonna leave here and then I'm gonna call it an episode. Ryling's obsession with honor and Thank you guys for... Without further ado, thank you guys for watching. If you liked it, leave a like down below. Subscribe today, and please remember, have fun playing in the dark. I'll see you guys in the next one. Night.